Hey buddy, welcome to Ram TV and welcome back to my MLB The Show 20 Nick Mets franchise. This is episode 25 and here we are for the September 16th game. I'm, re I'm recording this August 4th and obviously the baseball season has started and some weird things happen with the Mets. Um, there's a certain gentleman who decided to just opt out of his contract. Um, that is Jonas Cespedes. I'm a little unhappy about how he handled things. I feel like he could have told the team or somehow figured out what to do. And that really just irritates me. I don't care if he is hitting full with 14 home runs to 51 average. I That really upsets me and I think I will release him. I don't care for him right now. Like that really upset me. Like when I heard that he didn't show up to practice or he, he didn't report. He didn't tell anything, anything to anybody and all of a sudden just left. I was like, really? Are we two years old where we don't tell our our like, our like bosses where, where we're going or what happened? Not cool, man. So I decided to release him. Uh, play, I feel like we're playing. Whatever, you're gonna get DFA'd. Don't really care. Damn it. Well, you're done playing for the rest of the year. Don't really care. That really irked me. But now, we're going to be playing against the Marlins in New York for 99th. We got Jacob DeGrom, who's 18 and 6, against Sandy Alcantara. That's a curveball. Shoot. Ooh, that got him. That froze him. That is out number two here in the second inning. That is his first strikeout. Okay. One, two to Lewin Diaz. Got him swinging with a 99 miles an hour fastball. Sad is retired. There you go. That's a base hit for Alonzo. He is on at first here in the fourth. At second. At the first. Double played and the inning. Great. Defense on that sacrifice bunt. With the way this guy's throwing on the mound, you cannot be chased. There you go. That's going for driving to deep left field, and it's going to be at least a double. Takes the turn and heads for second. He's set and the 2 2 pitch. Mind the right side. Drives it to deep right field, and it's going to be caught. Now Conforto tags up. He's on third with one out. Yeah, give me the same at bat. He's going to drive the run in. It's going to be one nothing Mets here in the fifth inning. Good play by Ramos to just play it and have Conforto run it in. One and two to Jonathan Villar. Fools him. Curveball. He doesn't believe it. One two to Dickerson. Ah, he's going to be a double. For, for the Marlins here in the fifth inning. And he is in. No runs, five hits, and no air Swing and a miss. Another strikeout for DeGrom getting, getting Hal Ramirez. He is pumped. Conforto looking to add to this, uh, this lead. And that's driven deep, deep. But that'll stay in the park as it's off the wall. Cano blows through the stop sign. Play the plate and he's gonna be out. Oh, damn it. Oh no. <laughs> oh man, I wasn't paying attention to Conforto. Turn to the jazz. Chris home. Wow. Got him! Nick the corner! Out number two here in the eighth. No! Come on, come on, get the ball faster! Oh no! That's a base hit that makes things one to one here in the eighth. The two men on. Got him! Froze for Valley with a two seam fast. Swing and a drive. This is gonna be a walk-off. It's gonna be a walk-off. 
No, it's going to be against the wall. It's going to be another double for Michael Conforto. That's his third double of the game. Narrowly missing a walk-off home run. Let's go home, boys. Let's go home. This is a walk-off home run for Dominic Smith, number 26 of the year. That's a two-run home run. Don Manley cannot believe it. But the amazing Mets win again. Number 99 of the year. Look at Tebow. <sighs> Excuse me. Dominic Smith, the hero of this game. That is how the Mets season has been. Clutch hits. Big hits. Dominic Smith, no different. Boom. As soon as he made contact, I knew that I was out of here. Sending the Mets fans home happy tonight. It was mostly pitching and defense in this one, but the man you see here made some noise with the bat. And as a result, he's our yeah, top. Sort of obviously the played the game with two yeah, or three doubles, actually. One, uh, we end up with eight base hits, three and one. Dellen is now six and one. Unfortunately, no run support for the Grom. What else is new? Um, but I'm okay with it. I'm okay with this W, obviously. Um, so the next game we're going to have is going to be with Noah Syndergaard as we're wrapping up the season. So many games left. Let's see. Here. Win, and we won our 100th game. Okay, we won against the Rangers. Auto. We won against the Phillies. Now, DeGrom's 19 and 6 with a 3.2 ERA. We got Noah Syndergaard looking for his 13th win of the season in Philly. Um, let's see. This will be the last game. So, after this game, I'm actually going to go to the playoffs. Let's see the uh, awards races here. Get Alonzo look like he's still the MVP with 59 home runs. Looking for one more to get 60. He's still, yeah, I mean, you know how hot he can get, so never know. Um, looks like he's going to pull away with this. That's going to wrap it up for my episode of my MLB The Show, New York Mets Franchise. Don't forget to click the like button, leave in the comments below. And if you haven't already, follow me on Facebook Gaming. It's facebook.com slash remtv1. Hope you guys have a great day. Take it easy and peace.